Hello everyone, welcome to the third video of Flutter Tutorials by Knowledgeify YouTube channel. Today we are going to write our first Flutter app. So, um, without further ado, let's get started. Um, first, what you're gonna do is um, open uh, the Visual Studio Code program. and uh, once it's open you need to um, press Control, shift and p um, now as you can see i i have a some kind of window so you need to type um, flutter when, uh, as you can see, when you type Flutter, you can see few options. So um, you need to select Flutter colon new project. Now in this um, this step, you need to provide a uh, project name. So I'm going to uh, name it as Hello World. Hello underscore world and press enter. Now um, you need to a uh, select a location. So I'm just going to select my default folder, which is um, Flutter projects. Now um, it might take some time to uh, create this project, as you can see it's uh, downloading some files from the internet it, this might depend on your internet connections speed keep that in mind so um, as you can see the uh, project is generated and this is a sample code provided with the project um, we can just uh, we can we can first uh, write uh, run this and see what it looks like. So, in order to run this, um, you need to um, first open the Android emulator. So, in order to open the Android emulator, I'm going to open the run command and type emulator space at pixel and press enter and um, it's booting up the Android emulator I'm just going to minimize this window Okay, um, it's uh, our Android emulator is all booted up now. So, uh, in order to run this, you need to either you can do uh, you can click debug and um, select start debugging or just press um, F5. So, I'm gonna f press F5. And as you can see, um, it's uh, starting the app. This might take a few um, seconds to a few minutes, depending on your computer speed.
okay as you can see our um, sample project is now open so um, this is a very um, small app all it does is um, count numbers when we just press this button so I'm gonna press it and as you can see it's uh, it's showing one and if I press it again to it's a very um, simple app um, so anyway um, uh, what we are going to do uh, today is um, we are going to write a hello world app um, so um, we are going to uh, stop this sample project from running and it um, stop the app um, I'm gonna make sure it's closed in the emulator assets okay I'm gonna close it um, now I'm going to oh um, before that uh, please make sure that your uh, your you have opened the uh, main dot dot file in the lib folder so that's the um, file we are going to uh, edit so I'm going to um, erase this code now okay and now um, let's get into writing our first flat wrap so um, the first thing you need to do is um, you need to write an import statement to import something called a material so I'm gonna type import single quotes and package colon flatter slash material dot dot and I'm gonna type um, send colon so um, essentially this um, material helps us um, build um, flutter components so um, now I'm gonna call the main method so I'm gonna type void main open and close brackets and the arrow function and now we are going to call uh, something called um, run app and um, as the parameter I'm going to make an object of our flutter class um, we haven't made that class yet but I'm gonna name it as my app so I'm going to go ahead and make an object of my app class my app open and close brackets okay so now I'm going to um, write the my app class um, class my app um, and in this tutorial we are going to make a make a um, stateless um, app so I'm going to extend a stateless widget stateless widget and open and close curl brackets now um, you need to um, override something called the um, build widget so I'm gonna type build as you can see it's already giving me suggestions um, you need to uh, select this build uh, widget uh, and it's as you can see it, it's taking build context so I'm gonna select that and I'm going to get rid of this comment 
also the null now um, we are going to return something called a material app so I'm going to type material app okay so um, you have to do a few things here the first one is a title keep in mind that this is not the title for the app bar I'll just type um, first flutter project okay so the second thing we need to do is uh, we need to uh, create a home widget so I'm going to type home and uh, I'm going to give it a scaffold so um, in scaffold um, we can uh, provide a actually it's not in ca ca scaffold uh, in home where we can provide a app bar so I'm gonna type app bar and I'm gonna make a um, app bar widget All right, so I'm going to give a title for the app bar and for the title uh, you need to make a text widget so I'm gonna type text and I'm going to um, pass the title as a um, sing, uh, in single quotes um, I'm going to um, name this as hello world or oh, wait uh, I'll, I'll name it as the uh, first first project okay so So the second thing you need to do is create a body for the app and um, I'm going to give it a center okay and in the center I'm going to create a child object And since this is a very um, small app which is just going to show as hello world I'm going to uh, give it a um, text so text and within uh, single quotes I'm going to type hello world and I'm gonna save it so uh, our first um, flutter app is now ready to run so I'm going to go ahead and run it um, you can either um, select debug and select start debugging or just press F5 so I'm gonna press F5 
Okay, as you can see, our um, first Flutter app is now running on our Android emulator. Uh, so, as as you saw, uh, it's a very um, easy project, but there are things you need to learn. Um, so, um, also th there's something else um, I need to tell you. Uh, Flutter has this thing called a um, hot reload. So, essentially, um, what it does is uh, when you uh, modify this code and the moment you save the code, it's going to automatically um, run that change in our emulator. So, let's uh, try, that, uh, try that. So, I'm gonna um, take the Visual Studio code here so you can see the emulator and the code in the same time and um, I'm just going to change hello world to hello knowledgeify and uh, right now I'm gonna press control s which is uh, a shortcut for sale so I'm going to press save and it's going to change hello knowledgeify so this is a pretty um, helpful and nifty feature in Flutter so um, I hope you enjoyed this uh, first uh, Flutter app video um, uh, if you learned something please uh, leave it a like and subscribe to our channel um, also don't forget to turn your notifications on so uh, you can uh, you'll know when we uh, upload a new video so that's it for today uh, take care and see you soon again in a, another video bye bye